I do in the comments right now, if you've ever considered trying to go and get your real estate license, did you know that the average real estate agent makes less than $5,000 a month, which sucks? So I have an online real estate side hustle for you guys that can dwarf that. What if you can make $50,000 per month with this online side hustle in real estate where you don't have to door knock, you don't have to put out flyers, you don't have to check with your warm market, you don't have to cold call and prospect or even do showings on any properties. On top of that, you don't have to even like do the traditional Airbnb model. You don't have to own any real estate, no real estate investment or anything like that. No purchasing properties or going to any real estate auctions. So what is this? This is the copy and paste rentals business model where I show you how to leverage other people that have real estate and make money through partnerships without having to own any real estate. And it can be completely passive after it's set up properly. Okay. So that is the strongest intro I can give you guys for this. Now, how many people have been successful with this is super easy. Okay. And is this business model actually uh, uh, real? You know, like, is it proven? Because the Bible says, let all your ways be established. That means don't reinvent the wheel. That means it needs to be proven already because then you can just hop on the train and cruise along with the winners. Okay. Well, if you've heard of Airbnb before, you know that Airbnb don't own any properties themselves. They're the biggest hospitality chain and have more hotel doors and all of that stuff, but they don't own them. But they make a percentage of the cut every time someone books on their platform. That is the most powerful thing that I've ever heard in my life. Turo follows suit and did the same thing. Now you can go on Turo and you can rent out cars if you want to like drive for Uber or go out of town and all of that stuff. They're blocking off Enterprise, uh, the company, right? <laughs> but the Turo platform don't own any of the cars themselves, but they make money. They're worth billions. So if you're going to learn from something, learn from something that's worth billions or trillions, not the average millionaire. This is why I always bring you guys something that I haven't invented, something that I've mastered and taught others and proven and made millions of dollars off of, but I didn't invent it myself. I want you guys to be able to look out into the world, say, OK, Yazrael told me about that. Like he said that this is what we're going to be doing. I want you to see my testimonials, even though I tell you guys to stop watching testimonials and become one. If you need proof, it works. You see my student for 140 K in less than 90 days. Coach Keach, you've seen uh, Hafiz made 1500 super fast off party buses, $2,800 in the first 24 hours of the uh, the brother Shaquem putting his listing on one of the platforms that I teach you guys about. Yo, it works this fast without you having to own any properties. Since you don't own any properties, that means you don't have any overhead at all. So what if I can show you how to send a simple message to a person that does have overhead or a person that does have properties, show them how to tweak their listing a little bit and you get paid for it. Oh, snap. And no, this is not real estate. Uh, this is not Airbnb co-hosting or co-listing or something like that, but it's similar to it, but it's not the exact same thing. All right. It's about repositioning. So what do I mean by that? So let's say you go on Airbnb right now. I'm going to give you the game. I'm not going put shackles on the game. You go on Airbnb right now, you find a property that's worth five to $10,000 per month to rent out on Airbnb. It don't have to be that high because some of you guys might be intimidated to reach out, right? But let's say you reach out or you have a virtual assistant reach out. You don't have to do this. Remember, we wanted to be uh, passive eventually, right? So they reach out. Um, who are we reaching out to? We're, we're looking for listings that have been on there for a while, but don't have a lot of reviews. These listings either don't have a lot of reviews or they don't have any at all. And you're like, huh? But you want to make sure that they're actual real listings, though. <laughs> OK, now. So why are we reaching out to those? Because these people did all the work of fixing up their property, did all the work of making it look good. And then they even listed it, letting you know that they want to be booked out. OK, they want to stay booked because they you don't get into real estate without wanting it to be passive. So we're going to reach out to them. We're going to say, yo, I have a few opportunities. So how I teach you guys how to find these opportunities, we use Google, we use SEO. So what do I mean by that? OK, well, we locate the places that their Airbnb is in. In that Airbnb, 
uh, in that location, there are certain strip malls. There are certain landmarks that people that come from out of town want to visit. There are certain restaurants, certain stores and all of that stuff that people will be searching online. There are certain events, parades, all of that stuff. For example, if you go to Google and you search Airbnbs near Disney World, OK, when you go on Airbnb, these people list they name their listings stupid stuff. Oh, four bedroom, very beautiful with a pretty view and all of that extra stuff. No, BS. You want to take advantage of Airbnb's SEO and you want to take advantage of Google's SEO because it's going to rank in Google. If you can pick the proper keywords and everything like that, it will rank in Google for certain things. So if we say Airbnb near Disney World with four bedroom, plus it comes with AC. So you want to we show you exactly how to create the titles and everything in there so that it ranks in Airbnb's search engine and it ranks in Google. So you can traffic help from both. So they'll stay booked up. They don't know these things. OK, uh, Airbnb for a bedroom near the intersection of Chippewa and Kings Highway. They, they don't know to do these things. Right. OK, so we teach you how to do that. Right. And what happens is you, you control the new listing that's going to be on there. But when a person requests a listing or, or booking with you, that is when you, you you pretty much drop services like I always teach you guys. So this is copy and paste rentals, guys. And this is the easiest online real estate side hustle ever, guys, because guess what? You don't have to deal with them. Once you pass them off, you don't have to deal with the customer service unless you want to get paid more from the uh, the original listing uh, owner or whatever, but you don't have to deal with the customer service. You don't have to put chocolates and wine on the pillows. You don't have to go in there and clean. You don't have to handle cleaners and you don't have to handle who's going to check in and what's the code, the lockbox key and all of that extra stuff that you normally have to handle with this Airbnb stuff. That's why this is the best online side hustle out there. Guess what? You can copy and paste your way to the hundreds of thousands of dollars, guys. And that we have a community and there's only 97 bucks. You get the full training for this in the first pin comment. First pin comment is going to go up. OK, I promise you it's going to go up. But right now it's only ninety seven dollars. You get the community, you get the training, you get coaching, you get scripts and everything that you need for you to be successful with this online side hustle. And it will become passive income. I strongly suggest you check out everything that I'm talking about. We have the testimonies. It works. There's no way around this. You can't say, oh, well, how do I know it works? It works. It works. So if you want something that works, if you want to be able to just copy and paste a few extra thousand dollars into your freaking life, how much better would you feel instead of learning a business model of this that feels like a college course, that feels like you have to go get a degree and, and, and put up with a lot of BS and it's experimental. A lot of this drop shipping stuff, a lot of this other stuff that you guys are doing, I'm not going to bash it. It works. But is it copy and paste simple? If you want something like that, Go to the first pin comment. We'll love to have you in the community. I strongly suggest you get in there and I will welcome you in there personally. We'll see you there. Hey, my name is Kim and I am the owner of KN Network. And I just want to get on here and to express my gratefulness and gratitude to Yaz Real Israel David for interviewing me. OK, and when I tell you when my interview dropped, I got instant messages, people flooding in that wanted my services. And I've been booming ever since, you know, not exaggerating, booming ever since. And his audience, oh my God, I have sweet people that came in from his audience that actually wants help and loves my business model, you know, and they are they are just amazing and i'm just so happy that i went ahead and did the interview i was a little bit like i don't want to do no interview but the interviews is the way to go if you're trying to get your business to a broader audience all right gone are the days when you are doing soup like outreach and I, you know i'm not downing the outreach but it's it's just not popping like interviews all right so if you are on the fence of working with Yazrael David Israel I'm here to tell you you are missing out you are missing out I have made thousands of dollars and I'm not even exaggerating I have filled up my Facebook paid membership all right and it's filling up it's filling up and I'm super excited with 2024 uh, working with David I have some more interviews that's coming up with him if y'all don't want to get on this well, leave it all to me all right <laughs> peace 
guys, how's it going? Keith Chosen Sweat here. First thing in the morning. Look, eyes are still down below, right? Listen, I woke up to money from an interview from my guy, fly guy, David Robinson, right? So we interviewed talking about how I went through his class and I made 140000 in 90 days. And then I took what I made from that and started my own business with teaching people how to trade. And from the interview, people are seeing so much value in that video. They're booking right now. It's already been three people have booked in less than 24 hours. No one is out. Keep sweating shows. I see the top of the bottom. too crowded. Hello, everyone. Good morning. This is Chairman Hafiz. I wanted to give a quick update on the uh, drop servicing. We have a party bus and limousine set up with uh, Auntie Job and David in uh, Seattle and Tacoma. He uh, gave us a strategy of listing it on a particular series of job sites and posting some ads. Leads came in. We had a difficulty in our offer. He helped us adjust the offer. That hit. We got our first payment. It was for $1,500. Uh, we're going to attach a screenshot. I just wanted to let you guys know that the strategy works. You have to apply it. If you don't get your offer right, you have to tune it. Don't lose hope and just execute, execute. It's all about execution because once you get that offer right, it'll convert more. Now we have bookings for May, June, and July as well. So it's begun. Took a little bit of effort, but David was right on and the execution was on us. We should have tried harder on the very first attempt so we would have saved some time and double checked the offer before we sent it out. But we did get our first payment on the second try. Thank you, David. Thank you, Theo. Thank you, Keith. Thank you, Dijon. What an awesome team over at Anti-Job Support. And I'm glad to be part of this organization.